Hello, my peoples. It is day 52. Day 52. Ooh. We are on our way to the Plaza Bank for the last time while I'm in Reno. Ryan will be sitting there, sitting there bored out of his mind. At least he'll be cool though and not hot. Uh, but tonight, he will be getting on the bus to go home. Yay. I'm, I'm excited about home. I'm not excited about the bus. I can't blame him. Uh, he's gonna... He, neither of us really have much money. Ryan has much, much less than I do, and so he's stuck taking a stupid bus for three days without having much of anything to eat well or anything to eat actually and I feel bad for him but I don't know really what I could do to help him out with that since I'm practically broke myself uh, but yeah that's that's what's going on with us I will be leaving tomorrow to go on a plane back to Reno if we could have just gotten a refund on the ticket, uh, we probably could have... It was taken a plane? Yeah. Which would have been nice. That would have been extremely nice. I mean, free drinks, freaking a day ride, opposed to my three to four days without using a drink or eat. I'm really not looking forward to this, bro. Oh. I don't know... Alpha, Epsilon, but I don't know what that top numeral is. Or I don't know if it's a numeral, but... That's what 10th Street should look like. Except we should have hospitals. 8th Street's down that way. Goodbye, 8th Street. Many, many terrible memories, but also good ones. <laughs> Right now I'm just taking video of some, well obviously surroundings, mostly so that uh, if I ever go back and look at these videos, I will be like, oh I remember that, or what not. Oh, uh, we didn't go do the thing we promised we were going to do. What? We were going to go to the, uh, the, thrift, the thrift store. What thrift store? Oh, Washoe Ark? I just sit there. Oh, they're closed on Sunday. Yeah. Dang it. Oh, well. Well, between you and me, we also forgot another really important thing that I meant to do. This is one. No. Looking into getting my, uh... Like well, stop, stopping by the courthouse. To, to get a uh, release of information. I have to come back here when they do it. I want to get, uh, oh, look, there's a flag randomly up there. Up here. I want to get my childhood records. Huh? Not those, dummy. I don't want the record for me going to juvenile detention. Yes, I got in trouble as a kid and went to juvenile detention. Most kids have if they grew up in group homes. I want juvenile uh, records from when I was like in family court and stuff like that, Ryan. Accidentally. Oh my gosh. Almost tripped right there. The cement was higher in one spot. It's a nice little area. Hey, they just had trees and fans everywhere. And air conditioners. And waterfalls. All along this? Yeah. And mm. snow. Snow. Trees, fans, air conditioners, waterfalls, and snow? Yes. 
I think you're asking for a lot, buddy. And Santa Claus. And Santa Claus? And Santa Claus. Santa Claus? We're almost by the Pacific. It's right there. Man. So fun being appropriate on these videos. Ryan wants to be himself. But I, I require a level of professionalism on my videos because I know family's watching and stuff. So boring. So that's why we call it Boring Incursions. It should be called Boring Incursions. You're hurtful. I'm sorry I'm hurtful. It's just I'm bored. Um, be yourself. You got one minute to be yourself. No, you got 15 seconds. That's what you wanted to do. That was boring. He's all talking about being himself and that's what he wanted to do. I know you'll get mad at me if I do anything. So. Now you got 15 seconds to be yourself. You could be, you could be inappropriate, you can curse, just don't strip. 15 seconds is not long enough. Accept what you can get, buddy. Yeah. Fine. It's his fault that this is boring incursions. I gave him the opportunity, and he did what? He rejected it. We're going on a veggie diet to get home. We're going green. Yep. Are you excited? Cents. Do I have 65 cents? Yeah, 65 no, I don't. Beautiful, shiny cents. No, nope, I don't. Sorry, buddy. Jeez, the day's only barely begun for you. It's hot, man. It's, it's over 100 degrees. It's hot for me, too, but I don't think of it like that. You gotta learn not to be so negative, buddy. You'll find more joy in life, even in the bad things, if you don't focus on it. Focusing on the negative things will, will give you... Yeah, yeah, negative and positive things. Too hot for that. <laughs> Shut up. Being rude, buddy. It's hot. Oh, well. Then I must be nice and cool. I am cool. Reno Regency Apartments. I want to punch your face, Josh. What? I want to punch your face. It's hot. I want to punch you. It's not very nice. You want to injure your friend? I want to, I want to like punch you and I my fist go through your head. Whoa. You These are absolutely atrocious touch screens for this place. It's a new thing that they do. Instead of asking you these questions back in the question or uh, exam room, they make you do it up here. It is there. It's really inaccurate. So I have to like focus exactly where the uh, arrow is off at. See, because it, it it places itself like below your your uh, finger. Uh, donation before I go back to Reno. All done. Virginia? Yeah, back to Virginia. Right. You're watching Family Man. The Family Man with Nicolas Cage. What'd you think Nic of that movie, Ryan? N N Nicolas Cage. I can't do a Nicolas Cage. Uh, I thought I thought uh, it was corny, because it's it was, a love it was, story. It was pretty corny, but I mean, it was me. I would have chose to be rich. <laughs> I was watching Viking. 
And they, at, right at the end of the episode, they did this thing called the Blood Eagle, where they uh, they put the victim or the the guilty person. Usually, is how they who it is. The one who's guilty of something. They put him on his knees, and he has to hold his he holds his hand up on these two little things, so his hands are out. And they take a knife and cut open his back, and then they take an uh, axe and. Uh, cut off his ribs and he's alive during all of this and then they take his lungs through the back and set them on his shoulders so it looks like an eagle with folded wings yeah it was really uh really bloody it sounds painful huh and if they don't scream like if they stay silent we're gonna go this way uh if they stay silent during the whole thing then they can get into valhalla but if they scream and stuff they'll never get into valhalla I think I'll, I think I don't want to go for a hollow then. <laughs> I remember when this used to be an empty lot. I always thought people would like sneak in here and like go skating in it. Do you remember when it was just an empty lot over yeah. the freeway? I don't want to go Josh. I don't want to go on the bus. Say it all sad and pathetically. I don't want to go. I don't want to go on the bus. <laughs> Step inside, it's cooler than here. Now I feel like we have to do something, huh? Can't do what? You can't put mean on the side like that. I swear to God, you're tall. Or, or my girl. Where? Where? Man? Man? Oh, it's almost over. I still have no idea. Oh, in jail? Why are we in the women's section, man? Come on. Northernmost point in the contiguous United States. No, I do not, John. Why don't you tell me where the northernmost point in the contiguous United States is? Well, it is not in Washington or Maine. It's in Minnesota. How do you know this, Mr. Alaskan? See that little thing that sticks out right there? That's Bring it the closer so I can see. The northernmost point in the U.S is that little jut that sticks out above Minnesota. I did not know this, sir. Yeah. But that's excluding a lot. In the, in the entire U.S., the bear of Alaska, which they don't even show it on the map. Do you want to become an, a professional Olympian someday? Oh, yes. You think you will be? Yeah. You think I'm going to look at back on this video that I'm recording in, in 10 years, and you're going to be like a gold medalist? I'm going to be like, yep. See, he was my friend. And then I'm going to try and get a hold of you, and you're going to be like, who the heck is this? Because you have no idea who I am. Yeah. Do you have a Facebook? I do. Should I add you on Facebook? Okay. I will. Because if you ever become famous and you're a gold medalist, I'm going to totally want an autograph. Got it? Okay. Well, this is a town right there called Barrow, and it's pretty boring. My dad went there once, and it's dirty, and yeah, it's not... A fun place to go, but it's the northernmost point in Alaska, which is the northernmost point in the U.S. Oh. What part of Alaska did you say you lived in? Palmer. South Central. South Central? Do they deal with gangs in South Central uh, Palmer, Alaska? No, they have gangs in Anchorage, but they're not really well known. Oh. They're like wannabe gangs? Ooh, I should. I gotta look up a uh, picture of. I live right. Right there. Where's that? What street is that? Hassan Bay Drive. Apparently, my phone can't get that bright screen. It like discolors. Oh, that's lame. Your phone is lame. There you go. I got it nice and clean now. Now I can see everything. Yeah. I just zoomed in. Yeah. Whoa. Let's see if I can find it. There's this place called Soldovia, Alaska, where I know a guy that has a cabin on the beach there. 
It's not like a California beach, it's an Alaskan beach, but it's still... What's that supposed to mean, though? No white sand. What, what color is the sand? It's gray. Is it like just pebbles? Uh, mostly pebbles. You could find sand, like um, soft sand in a lot of places, though. So, here's Alaska. This right here is the Kenai Peninsula. Then on the tip of it, and the tip. Here's <laughs> the color of the uh, the landmass too does not it lends to your joke if you think look if you, when you zoom in it was all tannish pink. Yeah, yeah, like uh, yeah. And this is Homer. <laughs> and this little jut of land where it seems like there's a road goes out in the middle of the ocean is called the Homer Spit. And at the very end is uh, a hotel called Land's End. Is that a natural phenomena or oh, yeah. something that was... Yeah. Seems like that is a great flooding danger right there. Um, it's not too bad. A tsunami yeah. comes by, everything there's done. Yeah. Huh, that's part of the fun. <laughs> but there's a Salty Dog Saloon, which is pretty famous. And over here, there's this piece of place called uh, Starvin' Marvin's. It's really good. But, Marvin, across Ketchumik Bay, there's Soldovia Bay over here. And there's a little tiny fishing village of Soldovia. It's really cool. They have a big 4th of July celebration every year, and usually I go to it. Cute. And then in this little cove right here, there's a cabin. And there's actually two cabins. He owns both of them. So he helped him build one that's right on the beach. And you could just wake up in the morning and go halibut fishing and then eat it that day. And it's so freaking delicious. We're taking Ryan to the Greyhound because no. we're tired of him, so we're abandoning him. Shipping him off to another state, right, Aaron? Yeah, what we haven't told him yet is we actually didn't get him a ticket. Yeah, that was just uh, a fake printout that we did have them do, Ryan. Yeah, well, no, that's not true. That's not true. It's a real ticket, but it only gets him about a quarter of the way there. So well, now he knows. That's okay. We, we already have all this stuff. Yeah. He's out of the house, so. Sorry, Ryan. Goodbye, Reno. No goodbye to us? I'll see you again in the bayou. You did just hear that we say you're only getting about halfway. You have to figure out the rest of the way there yourself, right? Figure it out. Okay. You might you might never see Blizzard again, Ryan. It'd be horrible. Yeah, I might never see Blizzard again because people keep calling him Falcor. Falcor's such a better name for him, though. He's all wild like a blizzard and he's all white. He loves snow. He looks like Falcor, the dragon dog, or the dog dragon from the he's never ending the story. Thank you. But he's a, he looks like a dog it's, that has a dragon body. I'll have to show you Falcor at some point and you'll see he looks a lot like your dog. I've seen Falcor before. I watched never ending story like recently. His name's not Micah. Not Micah. His name is Aaron. Save that apple? Ew. By the time he finishes that book, it's going to be really gross looking. <laughs> Triumph Tattoo, is that a new place? Yeah. It's been around for years. I hope I just get one seat by myself on the way there like I did the last time. For he's a jolly good fellow. For he's a jolly good fellow. For, well, 
Oh, this is a good fellow, which nobody can deny. It won't smell as bad this time. Which anybody can deny. Well, this is where your new home is going to be for the next three days, Ryan. Well, not here, but on one of these buses back there. My home is wherever. Are you going to come across? Wherever the road takes me. No? You're not going to see Ryan off, huh? I'm seeing him off right here. You're not going to leave, right? You're going to wait for me? Oh, you're going in? Yeah. I'm, I'm going to make sure that everything's all right. Scared, Ryan. I don't like traveling. Though. Are you conflicted? See, part of you's got to be happy you're going home. Part of you's got to be sad that you're leaving Reno. There's part of you that's got to be depressed you're taking the bus. Oh, I'm so conflicted right now. That's where your home's going to be on one of those. Customer drop off. No parking. I love how like half of these cars are just sitting. All right, Ryan. I have to stay. There goes Ryan. He's got a really long trip ahead of him. Doesn't even know I'm still here. see a movie. Probably gonna see Tammy. Ryan's about to, she's probably already pulled out. One last movie before I go home. Movies end, but our loaded potato skins are endless. Garlic basil bruschetta, endless. Buffalo wings, that's right, endless. For a very limited time, at Fridays, each person's pick of one of our best handcrafted appetizers is now endless. One last hoorah, so if gonna see Tammy. Bucks, you're in, and your night out keeps going long after the movie. Endless apps, only from your friends at Fridays. There is one thing I, I can't live without. It's you. Talking to the European Journal of Obstetrics. Doesn't sound like a job interview. How much? I'm not going to take your money. You took masters. That's what I... I'm assuming it's not an accident. Meeting in a hotel. Masters of Sex, season premiere, Sunday, July 13th at 10. Only on Showtime and Showtime Anytime.
and smiles are contagious. Chevrolet is merging the physical freedom of the car with the virtual freedom of Wi-Fi to become the first and only car company to bring built-in 4G LTE Wi-Fi to cars, trucks, and crossovers. It's the new independence. What kind of a man do you want to be? A man who loves, forgives, embraces his family. A good man feels bad when he does something wrong. You understand? Sunday, July 13th at 9, only on Showtime and Showtime Anytime. How can a tablet replace your laptop? Start with the best writing experience. Make it incredibly thin. Add an adjustable kickstand. A keyboard. This a USB port. Thumb. And the freedom of touch. And of course, make it run Microsoft Office with the power and speed to do real work. Introducing Surface Pro 3, the tablet that can replace your laptop. No, I can't. And now, not Red's yet, at least. What do you guys have? Uh. Red's Apple Ale. Crisp like an apple, fruit like an ale. We came to LA to serve a strategic response team. Mechanical prodigy, world-class shrink, a human calculator. It's you on software. I need you. Do you have your equipment? Thank you, please. I need you to get me into a Ferrari 458. Was the gas cap open? Pull up the ECM chip. Burn. Welcome to Milk, a new way to discover music. Just turn the dial and listen. I be the I G G Y with my name and bow. I've been working, I'm up in here with some shiny to throw. This commercial's dumb too. You no know lists. Hold up, wait a minute. All good, just a week ago. Crew at my house, and we party every weekend. So on the radio, that's my favorite song. No searching. Just millions of songs. Finds the ones you like. The ones you haven't heard yet. And the ones that make you dance. Milk, the next big thing in music is here. Download now on Google Play. Only on Samsung. Yesterday, they were filming for American Idol over here. This also is where they do the ice skating every winter. It's where they make the ice skating rink. And before it was this, I remember when it used to be the Mapes Hotel. Before they blew it up in 2000. Looks like it's a giant butterfly. So I saw Tammy. Tammy was decently funny. Uh, one out of ten, I'd probably rate it six and a half. 